Dr. Baron Hall is a dentist. He performs the usual procedures, root canals, extractions, crowns, even braces. Yet his patients never complain above a whimper. Hall is a vet who specializes in dental care for animals, something he says people hardly think about. Because it's hidden behind their lips and they're eating well and they're wagging their tails, everybody thinks everything is fine. And that's not good because bad dental health in your dog or cat can lead to some serious periodontal problems. Periodontal disease can lead to pain in the mouth. It can lead to uh, difficulty eating. It can have uh, an impact on heart disease. The best way to keep your pet's teeth healthy? Try to brush them yourself or have them examined and cleaned once a year by a vet. Look for chew toys or treats designed to clean the teeth. And keep an eye on your pet's mouth. Donna Peterson noticed an abscess on her dog Lightning's lower lip. The dog was diagnosed with mouth cancer and had part of her jaw removed. Catching it early saved her life. She's just back to normal. But abnormal bumps aren't the only signs of problems. The biggest thing is bad breath or halitosis. The other thing is fractured teeth. If your pet has these problems, visit your vet for a checkup. If it's serious, they'll refer your animal to a specialist. For today's Health Minute, I'm Melissa Long.